Hey everyone, this is my ShopRite couponing haul for the week of December 4th through December 10th. I end up spending a total of $12.96 out of pocket. I receive back $8 from various rebate apps, making the net price for everything you see here $4.96. And on top of that, I also received a $0.75 cents Catalina off my next purchase for purchasing two of the Uncle Ben's rice. The Lindsay Peppers are retail price this week for $1.99. Purchase two, it brings it to $3.98. There is a dollar off a two printable coupon available on the website. You do have to sign up for an account, but it is quick and easy, and then you'll have access to print the coupon. And also a dollar off a two digital coupon brings it to $1.98. And on Ibotta, there is a dollar fifty cashback offer for each variety. So a dollar fifty cashback on the banana peppers and a dollar fifty back on the jalapeno peppers. So you get back a total of three dollars from Ibotta, making the peppers a dollar and two cents money maker. The sugar, flour, cookie mix, cake mix, and baking chips are part of a promotion. Pick five, you end up paying only a dollar sixty six each. The Duncan Hines perfect size is participating in this deal. So a dollar sixty six minus a dollar off coupon that I got from the Stop and Shop Savory magazine. It did scan no problem at the register, makes it sixty six cents. The Domino Sugar at a dollar sixty six minus a forty cents off of one manufacturer coupon that I had that did double to eighty cents off, making it eighty six cents for the sugar. The Gold Medal Flower at a dollar sixty six. I was lucky and happened to come across someone who left their flyer of super coupons. On the shelf and one of the super coupons was for the gold metal flower to make it 99 cents however it ended up taking off a dollar so I actually paid 66 cents for the flower the Ghirardelli cookies at a dollar 66 no coupons but there is a rebate on Ibotta for 75 cents back making the net price 91 cents and last but not least the Ghirardelli baking chips at a dollar 66 no coupons or rebates but that is a great price. The Advil Menstrual Pain, the 20 count tabs, is retail price for $3.99. There is a $2 off printable coupon available on coupons.com and also a $2 off digital coupon, making it free. You also may have a $2 back offer on Saving Star, which will make this a $2 money maker. The Uncle Ben's Flavored Grains is on special savings for this particular flavor at the store I went to, the Basmati Medley Savory Herb. They were on special savings to save a dollar and you're supposed to pay 99 cents because the retail price is $1.99 minus a dollar it comes to 99 cents. But because these are actually on sale for three for five this week, it still takes off the special savings of a dollar. So it actually rung up 67 cents a box. And with the flavored grains, there's a cat deal going on. When you purchase two, you get a 75 cent cat. If you purchase three or more, you get a $1 Catalina. And that is going on until the 19th of December. I purchased two. They rung up 67 cents a piece, which brings it to $1.34. I had a dollar off a two printable coupon from smartsource.com, bringing it to 34 cents out of pocket. And I did receive for purchasing two. A 75 cents Catalina. So if you are able to find any of the flavored grains on special savings at your store, this will be a great deal to do. An easy freebie this week is on the Danon Greek Crunch Yogurt. There is a digital coupon for one for free, so make sure you grab your free cup of yogurt. Another digital coupon freebie this week is on the Bush's Hummus Made Easy. It is $1.99 and I also picked up a can of Bush's Garbanzo Beans that was on sale for $1.09. Both of these products come to $3.08. The digital coupon again was for a free pack of hummus so it took off the $1.99 and I also use a dollar off manufacturer coupon off of one hummus made easy. It brought my total to $0.09 cents for both products. And on checkout 51, there's a dollar cashback offer when you purchase one Bushes Made Easy and one Bushes Garbanzo Beans or Black Beans in the same shopping trip. So it ended up being a $0.91 cents money maker. It is up to you if you want to grab the beans. If you don't, then you'll get a dollar overage on your order. 
but if you do, you will end up paying nine cents out of pocket, but after the rebate, it will be a money maker. If you don't need the beans, then I would suggest to just get the hummus because it gives you a dollar overage on your order. But just note that you need beans in order to actually make the hummus. As you can see, it says just blend with Bush's Carbonzo beans. So it's completely up to you. The Stacy pita chips are on sale this week for $2.99. The Pure Leaf is on sale for $1. Both products come to $3.99. There was a dollar off digital coupon off of one bag of pita chips. And I use a tear pad coupon that I found in store for 55 cents off of one bag of pita chips. It only took off the face value. It did not double. So both products come to $2.44 out of pocket. And on Ibotta, you get a dollar back when you purchase one bag of pita chips and one pure leaf. There is a breakfast promotion going on on participating products. When you purchase six, you end up saving an additional $3 altogether. So 50 cents off each item. They are already on sale. But again, if you purchase in quantities of six, you get an additional $3 off. I end up going with the orange juice, the teas, and the Eggo waffles. But of course, there are other items participating in this deal. So check out your sales circular to see what else you can get. The orange juice is $1.99. Because I purchased six items, it dropped down to $1.49. I had a dollar off printable coupon on coupons.com, bring it to $0.49. Cents. And on Ibotta, there's a $0.75 cents cash back rebate, making it a $0.26 cents money maker. If you do not want to buy six products in this deal, the orange juice is still a pretty good price because it is on sale for $1.99. Use a dollar off printable coupon, you pay $0.99. Cents. Submit for the 75 cent cashback offer, it ends up being 24 cents for you. So it's still a good deal if you don't want to purchase all six items and you just need orange juice. Definitely a great purchase price. The teas were 149, but once again, because I purchased six items, they dropped down to 99 cents a piece. Four at 99 cents comes to 396. I had a dollar off of two coupon. I had two of those, so I saved two dollars. Brings it to 196 or 49 cents each. The Eggo waffles were 199. But one last time because I purchased six items, they dropped down to 149. 149 minus a dollar off printable coupon that I got from Kellogg's Family Rewards website. Brings it to 49 cents and is a cashback offer on Ibotta for 50 cents when you purchase one. Making the waffles free and on Saving Star, I have an offer. I believe it expires on Wednesday. Purchase $30 in Kellogg's products. You get back $5. So I think this might be the last product I needed to complete that deal. So I should be getting $5 back for purchasing $30 in Kellogg's products. The Teatly Super Teas are on sale this week for $2.99. I had a 75 cents insert coupon that doubled to $1.50 off and I stacked that with a 75 cents off super coupon. I believe in my last ShopRite video I told you guys about this booklet and to keep a lookout for it. It is the wellness coupon book. I found mine at the end of the registers but the location for this book may be different in your store. If you can find it my suggestion would just be go to customer service and see if they can direct you to it. With the 75 cents super coupon, it comes to 74 cents. And on Ibotta, there's a dollar cashback offer when you purchase one Teatly Super Tea. It has to be one of the super varieties. Ends up being a 26 cents money maker. The Barilla Pasta Sauce is on sale this week for $1.49 when you purchase in quantities of four. So I purchased four at $1.49, comes to $5.96. I happen to have 75 cents off of one printable coupons that unfortunately are no longer available from coupons.com. They all doubled to $1.50 off, so it took off a total of $6. And I also use a 50 cents off of one Barilla Sauce Super Coupon, making the sauce a 54 cents money maker. Okay, so real quickly, some deals I wanted to do but wasn't able to. The store that I went to didn't have the Smart Made Frozen Entrees, unfortunately. They are part of the Pick 5, Pay $1.99. We do have coupons available for this product. We have a dollar off a two printable coupon, and there is also an insert version of that coupon as well for a dollar off a two. 
and on Ibotta, there's a dollar cashback offer when you purchase two. So if you purchase two of these, essentially they will end up being a dollar a piece if you use the coupon and claim for the Ibotta rebate. The Orida potatoes are part of this deal as well. And on 51, there's a dollar cashback offer when you purchase two. And I just love me some TGI Friday wings. I did use the ShopRite from Home app to locate a store near me that has the Smart Made, and I did find a store. So I will be stopping by later on the week and getting in on this deal. The Oreo churros. Hopefully, I'm able to find the insert coupon for a dollar off. As you can see, there also is a dollar off digital coupon. You pay 99 cents. And on Ibotta, there's a dollar cashback offer, making them free. The Jones sausage is on sale two for four. As you can see, there's a digital coupon that makes it two for three. And I have an insert coupon for $1.50 off when you purchase two, making each box 75 cents. So those are the deals that I weren't able to do this trip, but later on in the week, hopefully I can pick up the items I just shared with you. And that is my ShopRite couponing haul for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed the deals, please hit the thumbs up. If you would like to see future couponing hauls, please subscribe. I had quite a few Ibotta rebates within this haul, if I am not mistaken. For you Ibotta users, you guys already know that December is a big month. We have a $20 bonus. And for that, personally, I have to redeem 65 rebates in order to get the $20. So I am trying my best to find the best deals I can do in order to track towards that bonus. I did a special Walmart Ibotta haul video where in that video, all 10 items I purchased are eligible for rebate on Ibotta and it ended up still being a money-making trip. Thank you guys for watching and remember, the coupon game never sleeps.